Hello everyone film record and today I will tell you about a film in which there are several young guys. We found ourselves in one of the most terrible traps in the car underwater. Before we begin, I remind you that your support is more important than ever to us, what is needed in order to support us. Well, just put a like and subscribe to the channel, this will be enough, but as we continue in. The sunken armored limousine, the driver, and passengers come to their senses with a little water in the car and it does not fill up quickly. Matt, who is behind the wheel, is trying. Break out the glass. Because the doors do not open and finds that the leg has been pierced through and through. The others in the cabin start screaming and panicking. Matt notices that a girl named Jessie is unconscious, he notices a phone at her feet. In a few attempts. Get him. Him. It turns out to do it, but. The phone is completely wet, Matt remembers how it all began, Jessie, the daughter of his boss, the rest are and her friends. And a guy named Brand they met after a long time, and Jessie is not yet seen, expresses his warm feelings about their meeting in the salon of a limousine, everyone. Panics and only Eddie retains control. He says that they won't be able to break the windows or open the doors due to the pressure difference, before opening the door, the cabin must be completely flooded, but their air will run out before the cabin is filled with water. We are meanwhile bandaging his leg. He reminisces again. This time, he remembers sitting with Jesse and his brother at the Jesse. Dellen Cafe. Just good friends. Ahmed was already working for Jesse's father as a driver, going out to talk with the boss, Matt notices how some guys are digging into his brother, but they quickly leave later. It turns out that Matt is not only a driver, but also a mechanic, his friend works with him, who communicates well with the boss. We will restore the car for his brother, but Hector distracts him and shows him a brand new limousine. Later, we drive our boss, who watch an interview in which he justifies the reduction of staff because of him many people have lost work the brain says what it wants throw out emotions and they ride on shooting range after we get a gun from accurate target shooting because only the boss can trust him with the safety of his daughter at the moment and why is he an excellent shooter in the car we hear the phone ringing in Jesse's bag but he can't pick up the phone because he doesn't know the password in another flashback, Honey comes to his brother's room and sees that Togo's face is broken, but the brother says that there is no need to get involved in this matter because he doesn't want us to waste our lives on him. The brothers start fighting and arguing, and Matt speaks. It is impossible to create from the family. What helps them reconcile? Later, the delinquents are beaten outside the school. And only the guy Jesse stands up for him, he does not appreciate the care and leaves, lowers the barrier separating the driver from the passenger. Jesse's boyfriend immediately asks what's wrong with his girlfriend, to which we say that she's under something, then the girl in the cabin manages to get through to the rescue service, and she tells where they are, but the phone turns off. They start to panic again and suddenly the current begins to shake them from side to side. We head off. And he remembers how he walked with a girl and did not answer his brother's call, and then found him dead next to scattered pills. At the funeral, he was supported by his girlfriend Jesse and her boyfriend, as well as a friend and that's all. They helped him come to his senses in a limousine, the guys begin to swear and blame each other for what happened, but most of all they freak out. It is this guy that he begins to tell the secrets of the girl next to him and tells the guy, Jesse, that something was with him. He claims that it is exactly one of them who is to blame. It all started with the club, which the guys came to relax, but there they began to pack a boon on them. It arrived in time and dealt with everyone. The main paranoid thinks that it was Honey who set it all up and decides to take the gun from him. He tricks Matt into opening the window and draws his gun. He begins to yell and threaten, and then shoots at all. Windows, 
since no one was hooked by the ricochet. Mother recalls that there is also a hatch, through which you can get in the trunk and get out, and they decide who will climb. However, there is a problem that the trunk may not open, and the person will be carried away by the current into the sea, a dark-skinned guy volunteers, because he knows the current but the psycho is against it and is going to send a girl at gunpoint because she was swimming. They successfully take the gun from this guy and give it back to Matt. E.T.I. decides to take a chance and climbs in the trunk, but the door does not open, and water begins to flood it. However, he still manages to get out, and we are transported to the moment when the accident occurred, they stop near the road to take a breath and they were attacked by some people in masks. Their target was Jessie, they inject her with sleeping pills and try to kidnap the nomad. Remembering that he could not save his brother, he decides to protect the tin at all costs, and he deals with the kidnappers, but not with everyone and leaves with the rest in a limousine, but on the way a car drives out at them, and they fly out of the way to the water. Utility The guys begin hypothermia and lack of air, and do not understand that they do not have long. And the violent guy apologizes to the girl. But Matt notices flashlights and divers, they were found. The guys also see them and start calling. But Matt notices the floating body of Eddie with a bullet through his head and shouts to the others that they did not come to rescue the scuba diver. Breaks the hatch from above and descends to them. He immediately begins to strangle one of them and breaks his neck, but the girl manages to deal with him. Water begins to rise and floods the cabin very quickly. Meanwhile, Jessie wakes up and hears both her friends and a friend dying in the salon. She blames the meth for not helping them. And then he blames himself because the only thing they had to do was pick up and we offer her the only option, he will open the window, and Jessie will swim as quickly as possible to the door. And once the cabin is filled with water, she can't open Jessie. Matt understand that he is dead, no, and say goodbye to each other. Jesse swims through the bodies of his friends and is grabbed by a scuba diver. We from screaming underwater and finds Bolognese slow by birth, and then pulls out a piece of iron from his leg, after which floats to the surface. In the morning, Jesse's father goes to meet the kidnappers. He brings them money and asks to let her go, but they are not going to do it. She was a guarantor. This makes it in time for the meeting and helps even the odds, but it doesn't last long, because Jesse's boyfriend shows up, who set it all up to take revenge on his mother's boss, who lost her job. Also, the guy director says that it was he who killed what was done, and set it all up like an accident. He starts freaking out and says shoot Jesse easily, but is shot by a friend of the meth and Jesse's father. However, it turns out to be the main one in this scheme. He wants the boss to transfer all the money to his account. But we start a fight with this Jesse, and a fight breaks out between these two, which Jesse's father earlier ends up with an ex-boyfriend. Matt, it turns out, is surrounded by his girlfriend and a friend at work, they are trying to win him over to their side. But Matt does not agree, they remain two on two, and Matt wins the fight thanks to Jesse's surviving father, then the honey falls on the floor, some time passes. And the boss thanks Matt, we go to his car, in which Jesse is already waiting for him, and they go away together. This is where the movie ends. Write in the comments how you like it and rate it from 1 to 10. And also do not forget to rate our video with likes. And most importantly, subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to be the first to watch new videos.